Hello everybody and welcome to Fran Bo, a creepy adventure game that tells the story of Fran, a young girl struggling with mental disorder and an unfair destiny. New on Steam released today, $14.99 is the price you'll pay. Um, gonna be doing a little bit of like a let's look at, I played a little bit of the game until I basically got stuck. Uh, hopefully I'll figure that it out this time. I have... I have problems with games and getting stuck in games, especially puzzles and stuff. So hopefully I don't run into that issue, but let's hop into the game. Yes, please do. Now I was going to tell the story, but this is going to tell the story right here. Everything is fine. It feels like heaven. I see my parents. Mommy, Daddy. They look happy. They do. They have a present for me. I wonder. I want that cake. I see cake. Aw, it's a cat. So pretty. So sweet and pretty. Dark as the deepest night. It's Mr. Midnight. Aw, it's so adorable. My best friend. Aw, my only friend. Aw. The cat is pretty damn adorable, I must say. We're having dinner, and I can see Aunt Grace, too. Hi, Aunt Grace. I really like her a lot. <laughs> you too, do you? It's Friday. My parents are going out. Butthole. Cat's got a butthole. <laughs> Aunt Grace takes good care of me. That cat is so adorable looking at milk. <laughs> We're having so much fun. Aw. Butthole. Uh, it's Monday night. I'm playing with Mr. Midnight. It's Monday night. I thought it was Saturday. Friday night. But something feels really bad. Okay. Hello, friend. How are you? A strange creature outside my window. He's got a top hat. He's pretty sick. I don't like it. It scares me. Suddenly, I hear something. It's Mom screaming. I want to know what's wrong. It's a bright light shines from my parents' room. I go closer. And closer. Oh, that ain't good. Mom? Dad? Please don't. Oh my. Mommy? Daddy? That is gruesome. Just imagine you being a young girl. Oh my god, that's gotta be tragic as all hell. Oh, kitty. Oh, my kitty. I like Mr. Midnight, he's my favorite. What are you looking at? Oh, he's angry. Oh, he's running. He's scared. What is it, boy? Girl? Are you boy or girl? Hey! Leave me alone! Oh, great. Lovely. Get abducted. Fran, please follow my voice. On the count of three, you will wake up. One. Two. Three. Three. <laughs> Friend, how do you feel? Fine, I guess. I just wanted I just want to see the same things. What? Sadness is something everybody has within. I wanna go home. I wanna go home. You can't go home, friend. Friend. Fran. <laughs> you have to get well. I need my cat, Mr. Midnight, where is he? Your cat is missing. It would be impossible to get him back. Bullshit, Doc. I'm getting Mr. Midnight. But how do you feel? But I have something for you, Fran. Oh, really? What is it? I'm skeptical already. See the desk? There's a package for you. It's from Aunt Grace. Take it. So, we get this purse. This lovely, adorable purse. It was my mother's purse. Alright, we got a purse. And we can examine this note. 
Here is the purse you like so much. I thought you could you would you would like to have it. I was thinking about you. I remembered that you liked combine <laughs> like to examine objects and combine them with other things. Good job, game. Hint hint nudge nudge. Uh also keep your purse away, use blah 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 blah. It's like an inventory system basically. She's worried about you. I'm worried too. Because I'm not crazy and I'm still here. Stop it. You're out of control, young lady. I'm so tired of all this. I just want to go to my room. Yes, you can leave before you do, but before you do, it's time for your new medicine. No more medicine. I don't want any more medicine. It's called Dutine and it'll make you feel relaxed. No, thank you. Although I'll, I like. Oh, no. 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 Nothing actually same yeah, I see. Stop small talk. I'm not taking no medicine. Fuck off. I didn't Yeah, fuck you. Go away. You don't have to do this all day. Take the pills now, whatever. Fine. You look like candy. I don't feel good. <laughs> uh, unfortunately, that's what Oh no! Take her back to her room! And nurse, don't let her take this ever again. No shit! I told you I didn't want the medicine! Crazy? F f call yourself a doctor? Jesus. So this is a, uh... Beware, Franbo. Okay, Mr. Goathead here. If you leave the house of madness, I will haunt you down. Okay, dog. I'll catch you. Whatever. You just go suck a D with your little P and bring you back. What? Well, I didn't read the last a bit of that. Aw, Fran, wake up. No. I can't do a cat voice. Medicine will help you escape. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you in the forest. Okay. Anybody else find it creepy that the cat is talking to me? I love you. Okay. I love you too, but you're creeping me out, man. I'm not even going to attempt that cat voice again. I do apologize. My sober day. Chapter one. I wonder how many chapters there are. All right. So now we're in game. So this is a point and click adventure game with a nice story behind it. I want to click. Cl click on the clown. I have to get out of here. Yes, I agree, Fran. Hello. I will get your nose. I will get it. Get his nose, mate. <laughs> you are a happy clown? You can make me laugh. A doctor's notes. Oh, boy. A patient was found near Oswald Asylum showing signs of psychosis. The Bow Danger Heart family tragedy details omitted treatment has tried different medications and have been canceled due because of side effects. So, it looks like, um, was that Dan Danger Heart? I guess that's how you pr would pronounce that. Hope this won't fall on my head while I'm sleeping. Yeah, I wouldn't want that giant freaking cross to crush my skull as well. Red and tiny uh, you from hiding from me. I hate this monster. Looks like I'm having dreams of this thing. I have to find Mr. Midnight. I have to find him now. I miss my kitty. He hides because he's afraid. He told me that the medicine would show me where he is. Okay, the medicine shows me where my cat is. Okay, if I read that correctly. Oh, sweet, sweet melody. Uh, we can go over here to this creepy kid. It's creepy. It's creepy. Hello, Phil. I thought I just woke up. How do I know this is Phil? Uh, how are you, Phil? I said, how are you, Phil? Jeez. Everybody says that I am sick. They're just stupid. They always say that. They're just stupid. Are you leaving tonight? Me? Uh, if you'll help me. If you'll help me. <laughs> I keep reading everything twice. The only thing I know is the office key. The, where, uh, there's a key inside? Inside the office? I saw the doctor write a secret code. What's the code? Tell me the code. The code to open the yellow door. Is that the yellow door? He doesn't want me to tell you. Fucking tell me, dude. Who? Him. Who's him? Okay. 
all doors are closed. You are my pris you are the prisoner of my game and nobody will help you escape. Okay. Leave me alone, I hate you. Okay. Mommy Daddy, I need you here. No worries. Just let the mon don't let the monster stop me. Uh okay. So I got a thing. You examine? Use. I got a key. I got a key. Use it on the door? The key on the door? No, of course not. It's locked. Use the key on the door. The key is too tiny. Look at this little doll. I have, uh, I used to have a blue dress like yours. Let's read his patient thing. Patient came to Oswald Asylum with his mother, Rachel Brunstone. Stone. Brunstone. <laughs> the boy has developed paranoia. Paran oh my god. I can't read. Paranoia is not yet. Oh yeah. Treatment. Daily treatment with Dr. Marcus Dern. How did you patient trust refused to be questioned? All right. Mr. Wood Horse having a good time. Can I sit? Sit down. If I sit down, I'll eventually get up. So what's the point? I completely agree with you. I want this teddy bear. Can I have the teddy bear? I hope somebody loves you. I'm pretty sure the kid loves him. Uh, click on the bed. Just click on anything. It's point and click. Okay, this is probably where the key is used. Yes, yes, I got it. There's something inside. Can I, can I take? Examine. Aw. Your eyes, dog, are creepy as hell. <laughs> oh, no, no. Click on the thing. Get the other things out. The drawer is empty. Okay, I have it. Uh, examine my hair clip. Uh, I should give give it to a good use? What? It probably doesn't say that. I'm dyslexic, so it's hard for me to read things, of course. Use the paper clip. Pick, pick that lock. I'm a 10-year-old. It fits, but there's two holes. Okay. Okay. Open this. I know this breaks that. Give me this. Give me. Okay, I got it. Now I can go look outside. Tower defense. We have a crazy person called Fran. Wheelchair? My legs are just fine. Anything in here? Empty bottle, empty glass, nothing useful. Look at the boarded up window. That's nice. How about this window? It's very, very peaceful. Oh, wait. Oh, I want to know what she's writing. I'm curious. Well, look at it. You're standing right there. Nurse will have to... No, it wouldn't let me never touch anything. Let's talk to her. Oh, Fran, you're awake. Good. How long was I asleep? Three days. Holy crap. Uh, was it the medication? Yes, it was the medication. That is why you're not taking it anymore. I did something? I see you're nothing but trouble. What is it? Broken curtains? I was trying to look outside, I accidentally broke the curtains. Poof! Accident accidentally, I have to fix this. Follow me. Oh. Okay. Oh, you know, fuck that. I'm looking at your desk. Read it. I'm curious, yes, but the nurse. I, I would be crazy to touch. Read the. I better go talk. Read. Pick the lock. Is there a lock on the desk? Why she's over there? I did. What? Um. Hello. Something is missing. <laughs> Have you seen the hook that holds the curtain up? See nothing. No, miss. I haven't seen anything. I will have to go find somebody to fix this. You little girl. Wow. Rude. You gonna open that door for me over here? Okay. Okay. Oh, maybe not. That would be that would be too easy. And yeah, now can I read what she was writing? Oh, I'll keep. I'll keep these patch. Okay, and stop blood. I'm gonna bleed in this game. There's no way I can read this. I can't read cursive. Violent trauma has it been impacting totally changing normal lives. The example of damage trauma. I'm gonna cliff notes tr people trust because the effects of trauma lead to mental illness. Uh, not trusting other people feel safe in this world can interpret as paranoia. Oh my god. Uh, drawing of a brain. Frontal lobe. Yes. 
can't even say paranoid. Para. Oh my god. Paranoia. Oh my god. Para. Fuck it. You know when you just can't pronounce a fucking word right? Hide. Uh, I think. Paranoia. I did it. I did it. See, I just need. A fuck. A gun? Why would the nurse have this? She wants to kill us all. I'm taking it. <laughs> uh, really need to get out of this place. Take it! I'll leave it as is. I really need to get out of this place. Whatever. Okay. Got everything? I kind of wanted the gun. Hide. Examine. My pills are inside. <laughs> I, I know it. I have to crack the code. I wonder if it has... Oh, can I combine with this to open it? Ugh, won't work. Use. Hide. Does that correspond to the number in the al al alphabet? Probably does. I did it! I got my pills. The pills. Kitty told me these would something another. So I have pills. Fair enough. Now I'm going to go use... This is what I couldn't figure out. Combine. Oh yeah, I can't combine that with that. How do I um take the pills? To happiness, you can see. Still locked. Oh my God, there's a creepy ass deer over here. Okay, dude, that's creepy as hell. Hello, I, I didn't read the. I'll try to put your head back on. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I can't help you, Mr. Deer. Um, um, I, um, sorry. Uh, I'm gonna play with Mr. Wooden Chair. How is that gonna help me get this damn door out? Uh, if I were bigger, I could take it down. How? how what? How, how does one be bigger? Hello, Mr. Ghost. Oh my god, the kid! Look at the kid! That is creepy as hell! What are you looking at me like? You, you're terrifying me! It actually startled me for some reason. A point and click game. Uh, the black... What is the black thing sitting next to you? Can you talk to me? Excuse me? What was that? Phil is playing with his uncle. Uncle is mad. Phil is crying. Do you see... Do you see the bird that killed me? What? Too quick, I can't read. There's cockroaches. It's this Ooh, it It was not me. Uh Blurry much? Okay. Hello, Miss Miss Nurse is uh dead. Watch your step. Hello, Miss Nurse. Hi guy. Uh get out. Creepy creature. I'm going down here. Absolutely not. <laughs> you can't tell her that. But she has to know, and you can't keep me away from her. Is this Uncle Betty, or... The reason is more clear, Grace. Uncle Grace. Uh, Uncle Grace. Sure, Uncle Grace. <laughs> no, it's not. Take her home. I want to take her home now. You can't. Frental Fran's mental condition is not appropriate yet. How does... Not appropriate? Is that the word that was Englished there? Hello, creepy... Very creepy thing in the... Is that my dead mother? Why is there a fox, and how am I... Already, how am I, what happened? It was not me. Hello? I wonder what, I wonder what she has to tell me. Who? This chick? The doctor has no soul. I'm going home tonight. Well, what's this poor fox? Oh no, foxy fox, don't cry. Okay. Alright. That's pretty creepy, I must say. Give me my head back, please. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll be leaving you guys uh, to, to do your your business. Oh, you're sleeping. What a sweet bunny. Sure, it's just sleeping. Uh, the drawer's empty. The drawer's still empty. And, okay, we've been over here. How about look out this window? Anything new? What's this right here? Oh, that's just the shadows. Okay. Excuse me, nurse lady. <laughs> this may be very useful. I got myself a pen. Uh, yarn pin thing mabobber of things. Now can I pick this lock? Finally, if I use and combine this with this. Oh, fantastic. My own, very own special key. I did it. Use on the thing. 
Woohoo! What was that? I don't know, lady. Daddy w was not there. Mommy wouldn't care. Okay, this is starting to get a little creepy. The screen shake is actually kind of making me a little nauseous, to be honest. Like the blurriness going in and out. Oh, what is this door? Okay, I'll leave you guys. Oh, my hello, okay. You're not my beloved friend, Bip Bip Burn. Okie dokie. Uh, I'm going to have to leave this episode here. I've been recording for about 25 minutes. I don't know how much of that is actually in there. Seems like a pretty uncut... Shut it. Pretty uncut video because there's like a story and I'm reading and things are happening nice and smooth now so far. So we're going to go explore the rest of this place in the next episode. But, uh, I mean, if you want to give this for a, give this a try for yourself, you can buy it on Steam, of course. I believe it is $15. But that's going to do it for this episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, all the great stuff you guys do. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Later.